Well, in the beginning, when I signed up, I really wanted to take a, a master's degree, and I knew that taking an MBA was, wasn't really for me because I worked in the advertising industry, and I just started doing digital marketing um, for my agency back then, and I wanted a more structured way of learning it. Um, and to my surprise, there were schools that offered it, but of course, I couldn't resign, so this program offered me the perfect balance of what I wanted, which is a master's in digital marketing, at the same time, still being able to keep my job. Because otherwise, how would I pay for my master's degree? So, so yeah, and that was kind of my motivation in the beginning. And as I went through the program and I learned about IE and how IE is about you know building entrepreneurs and at the heart of this the school is, is that kind of philosophy and thinking. And then I realized, it, why not? Why not create my own digital product, right? I mean, you hear about all these great stories of young people who just had an idea, and because it's it's fairly easy. I mean, it doesn't cost a lot to start a, a website or another a digital product. They go ahead and do it, and then some make it, some don't. So. That, that for me is, is inspiring and, and exciting. So, you know, as I went through the program, that, that was the other objective that I had in mind. My project is a travel search engine, and you're right, it's very up to date because it uses sentiment analysis and the semantic web, which is like, you know, evolving as we speak. Um, basically, it, we want to help people who want to travel to Asia to find the best kinds of activities to do in that area. And there's not one site that offers it now. And unlike, let's say, Google, where you type in, you know, things to do, etc., it gives you like a bunch of, of words that don't really make sense all the time. So ours will look at blogs. The results will come from different blogs and social media sites.